Okay, good morning everyone. I thought it might just be in a blur. Okay, so today I am doing, um, we went to the embassy in Fort Wayne, Indiana and went to the Festival of Trees and, and then we did some, um, took a picture of me and my husband, um, took a picture of my oldest girl and her husband and my youngest daughter which is our middle daughter and um, and then her, well her, her children the, the twins and the littlest one and then um, my second grand she was actually in a performance there and the other one was working so they weren't in the pictures but anyway um, somebody had asked exactly how I laid this out and so I'm going to show how I do this and um, first of all I kind of laid it out how I thought it, I would like to see it and this is like when we this is like you're seeing the entrance which is back here because I'm actually up above and then um, I'm going to put a card and then I, um, me and my husband, we actually got a picture right at the very beginning. Um, and so I'm going to put that here because I said we never get enough pictures. And so I'm just kind of laying out how I like the color. And then um, and alternating with the cards. Um, I know the first one I did, I did put, um, I think I had like five pictures of Skylar. So it's like I put them a little... I arrange them a little differently but with this one I'm doing it like this this is my oldest daughter so I'm putting her next and then I'm gonna alternate again I'm trying to spread my pink around because there's a lot of pink there's a lot of pink in my pictures and then this is my favorite picture it's um, a nativity in a glass ball and it looks and it looks like it was cut with a laser wooden and so I've got so that's the only actually close-up that I think I took and then I'm just kind of gathering or kind of arranging things with the pink around the outside or kind of alternating with the pink and then um, you know we came in a car so I had the car up there and it's the festival of trees so I have that up there and then we left, so I've got the car here. So I'm kind of, that's how I kind of arranged it with kind of a, a plan for arranging it. And then um, I'm gonna have the title right here where it says Festival of Trees. And um, I'll tell you, I have very, I don't have small letters that work very well, but these are kind of have a pink fleshy tone and it looks all right with it so I'm, I'm using those and boy do I remember what they are I, I think I think they're thickers I can't remember and, um, and I don't think I saved the top and then I use I'll make some of them dimensional and you know you always get two sets of cards so this one I didn't actually have two of but because I'm gonna layer you know letters on top of it it doesn't matter because I wouldn't be able to do that and then I use some different ones which I will get to after I um, tape these down so I'm gonna move these off and just show you how I tape the first ones and then I will tape the rest of them and you won't have to you know see me do all of them but I've also taken um, eighth off the top and an eighth off one side because the the second time I did it I think the first time I might have had used it in one piece I don't think so I don't remember <laughs> it's been a while now okay I know I don't really need to turn it but I, <laughs> I just did okay and I'm gonna butt this one right up against it and maybe kind of lift it up just a little bit because I really noticed where before I had a problem with um, coming off the edge. 
So I'm just going to run two pieces of tape kind of in the area that I know that they will end up. And this is my picture of the entrance. And I'm kind of using that corner to get it straight because I don't want to have to use the ruler for every single one. And I've kind of left it overlap a tiny bit. And then I'm going to put the next one and I'm going to push it right up against it. And I have to tell you that um, I know that there are a few of these where they're taller. Because when I stacked them together, I could tell. <laughs> but I'm just going to work with it. Okay, so then, and you could cut them all down, make sure they're perfect. Okay, now I've got me and the hubby. I kind of wish I would have waited until I <laughs> took off my cape, but before I took my picture. Okay, now I'm really overlapping here, but the last time I had so much of the edge sticking out, I thought I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, just cut it off anyway. So, and then I will do the sec second one and do the same thing. And um, I'll start the other ones and then I'll come back and show you where I'm at. Okay, when I was doing this, this was hanging way off. And then the next one didn't at all. So this, I decided to pull it back a little bit. So, um, and then I'm just gonna kind of make sure that I end on this line. So I might overlap them a little bit here and there. And I'm gonna kind of tuck this in so I'm close to the edge. because the important part for me to see is that little nativity, because I just love that. Okay, so that should be good there. And I usually just do this. That's what I did with all the other ones. Okay, and I'm gonna slide this one under, picture above it, so I can kind of have a straight line here, hopefully. And then, I'll do the same with this photo. And I kind of push it under here. Maybe. It's a little easier before you put tape on, but <laughs> it's necessary. The tape is necessary. Okay, and so this one has to go under a little, and then I might have to pull this one out a little bit because I'm going to make this one even with this side. Okay, so I'll need this out just a little bit. I mean, it's a little fussing, but I love it. It's a great way to use your cards, use several pictures. Now, I will, you know, go through and glue underneath them so they lay pretty flat. So that's that part. Now, I will put the letters on. In fact, I think I'm going to put this on, glue them flat, and then I'll be back to put on the rest of the embellishments. Okay, I've got the title on and everything glued down. Gosh, lately, every time I <laughs> rub my hand over a picture, it's like there's something there. What is it? Okay, so um, right here, I had the exact same piece in my cut aparts, or in the fussy cut pieces. So I'm just going to layer this on top. 
I just love doing this because, um, you know, it's like, sometimes it's like, how do you lay them out? It's like, this just kind of gives you another way to lay them out. Kind of mix it up. Okay, now I have this. This was in the Fussy Cut piece. I think it's just a smidge. I don't know. It might be the exact same size. But then I'll cut this end off, and I've got dimensionals under this part. But, oh, I've got a little dimensional under there, so I'll end up be cutting that off. And then I have um, one of the front Christmas balls. Actually, I have two of the front ones. So I'm going to put this one here. And then this one, I put the dimensional just to one side. And you'll be glad to know that I pulled off all the other <laughs> tapes before. Okay, I'm going to have to get closer to this one because I don't want to have to have them in the wrong spot. And I just love the little, little bit of dimension it gives. And of course, I totally have it crooked. <laughs> oh, Terry, Terry, Terry. Okay. There we go. And then the wreath. And once I decided which ones I wanted, I just cut those out. And then I still have several of the cards left, probably enough, you know, enough to, that I could do this again, just using different ones. Now this was a little bigger piece that was in my cut aparts, but um, I asked my um, my right hand man <laughs> what he thought of this one if or if I should use the smaller and he goes I like the bigger one better <laughs> so I'm using that one and then I have all the gingerbread houses and everything and so I just cut out this part I didn't cut out this and then um, right here, I'm going to add a sleigh because I have this little empty spot here. So I'm just kind of changing it up a little bit. And I cut some of my skinniest, um, what is it? The Dollar Tree <laughs> dimensional tape. I cut it really small and did a few of the rungs of this little sled and I had two so I could have done this but I kind of like it facing in to my pictures so I'm putting it there and then I'm going to cut this off with my biggest scissors and you can see where I'm out of the or off the paper but that's why I cut a smidgen off of it Now I told you how I don't like to cut off the edges because I hate it when the flowers look like they're cut off. But they did it first, so it's already cut off. <laughs> I mean, you know, the one was cut there anyway. So that's it for today's. Oh, and this is the collection obsession. And I actually, so this was page number four. And I don't know how I have all this stuff because I know one of them I did two layouts with so I actually have two of the same one yeah I have two of these left I have one of these left and this one here left I'll have to go back and make sure I did get because um, I know one of them I did with I did both granddaughter, the two older granddaughters, so I did two layouts. So, um, so I have actually one, one, two, three, four, five pieces of paper left, and several of the cards. I mean, there are six, there's ten, twelve cards. 13, 14, 15 cards left. And this was the pack that I actually had. Um, I had bought the 
pack of laser cuts, which I totally love because they're already cut out. So I'll check and make sure I, this is number four, but <laughs> I think it is. And the other ladies that are participating in the collection obsession, their um, links are down below. So make sure you go check them out. And if for some reason this is not number four, I'll be back with number five. Um, I do know there was one other thing I wanted to use this collection for, but right off the top of my head, I can't remember what it was now. <laughs> but thank you for joining me. Have a wonderful day, and I hope you try out doing using the cards because I just think it is so fun. And you know, when you get to do, you know, add that little bit of dimension to them and spreading the uh, pictures out, uh, I just love how it looks. So thanks again for joining me. I will have close-ups at the end. And have a wonderful day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.